All right, so it's Friday, which means today is the last day of work for me. Um, and then tomorrow I get my hair did. So stoked! Uh, I <laughs> I originally canceled this appointment because my husband got laid off because there wasn't enough work. I was paying most of the bills for a while there. We kind of depleted, eh, kind of depleted our savings. Then he was like, he told his boss, he's like, you got to lay me off. Like, if you don't have work, you have to lay me off. Uh, so there was, there were a few little blessings in there. We have a government program in our city where if your child's a close contact and you got to stay home with them, you get like, I think it's like $500 a week minus the taxes. So uh, he was able to collect a couple of weeks of that, which was dope. Um, and I just like picked up as many freaking shifts as I could. People, ha I mean, the other like super dope thing is people aren't calling in sick anymore. We're not getting tons of cancellations. So we're still working lots and we're able to get some other clients in there. I own a cleaning company with my friend. So we were like, enough of this BS government checks. We need to start our own company and like set a sustainable wage that we can actually live off of. So that worked out nicely. A photo shoot with the Always Deal guys um, over the weekend with all a bunch of the dancers and performers. That was amazing, always fantastic energy. Uh, they've been doing these like bi-weekly community parties. Also like, hello, bring the love back into my life. I freaking love it, so dope. Um, and I feel like I'm going through this transitional time in my life, which is why I'm getting my hair did. Uh, so sometimes when I find myself having a hard time, um, moving to the next step, I'm just like, all right, we gotta clean the house, we gotta rearrange your furniture, we gotta start a new project, we gotta, you know, maybe change your hair up a little bit. Now that, like, I'm in a financial place where I can afford to go get my hair done, Again, I feel good about it because I, I don't know if you guys have seen my video before about like finances. I used to make really silly, uh, what's the word, <laughs> purchases um, when I was broke and in debt and definitely shouldn't have, should not have been spending my money. So now I'm in a place where, you know, you've got the piggy bank, got the rainy day fund, got some savings. And uh, so if you've got to miss a day of work or somebody loses their job, like, we'll be fine, we'll be okay, we'll figure it out. But it just means, like, the luxuries are just going to sit on the back burner. I'm going to have to clean my own house or um, just, like, not have my hair done for a bit. Which, it doesn't look bad. It looks fine. It's fine. I just put some makeup on and then I feel like a human again. But, oh my god, I love this shirt. I don't know if you guys can see it because it looks like everything's flipped around backwards. But, woe is me. It's funny because, like, all these are my old rave shirts. Of course I did not shut the closet. This is how I usually do them. Just kind of, like, mess with the light a little bit. Stay tuned to the rest of the video if there is any of it. Um, got some content coming out. Oh, the other thing was, I haven't had a TV like to edit all my videos off of for a couple of weeks so i'm just gonna be dropping dropping a lot of content all of a sudden because i have all this content that never got finished editing here we are and gentlemen the after oh my god like look at this look at this look at this so fab so wonderful I am, I'm in love. Mel, I love you. Not my hair. <laughs>